Yo, Aki Gang, what's going on? It's your boy RK back with another amazing video on this channel. So today, guys, we are going to be doing this 95 rated exchange, and this might be a very good exchange if I'm being very honest with you. So, guys, for this exchange, you need 3 93 or 94 rated players. Anything is fine, but I would prefer 93 rated players because they're cheaper, obviously. The possible outcome for this is 95 rated Ronaldo card. If you pack Ronaldo, it's a definite profit, guys. Look at his price. He's going for 91 million. I know he's got lots of sale quantity, but I'm sure he'll max drop till 60 or 70 million coins even if you pack him it's going to be double profit so for this you need 93 rated players and right now the 93 rated players they're going for 10 million coins guys which is not so expensive if you ask me 30 million coins per exchange and you can do three of these exchanges on every account you're going to be spending 90 million even if you pack one ronaldo i'm sure you're going to make the coins back the next possible outcome is mohammed salah there are not many lot of high rated right wing cards so his price is not going to drop a lot guys right now it's like 44.5 million coins he might drop till max like 35 million or 30 million even if you pack him it's not a loss it's going to be a small w maybe and then we've got luka modric i think this might be a loss guys right now he's already 37 million coins i think he's going to dip till 25 million coins or something if you pack him it's going to be a loss a small loss so not a big one and the next one is theory only as you can see he's got 66.6 million coins market value i think it's going to drop till 45 or 40 million coins even if you pack theory only it's going to be a profit another w possibility and the next one is ferenc pushkas guys so right now he's already going for 44 million coins i think it's going to drop till 20 to 25 i mean he can be a little bit higher than 25 as well but if you pack him i think it's, it's going to be an l guys and also this is just my prediction of the prices guys i might be 100 percent correct or 100 percent wrong you know and the next possible outcome from this exchange is 95 cap de he's going for 30 million coins right now but he's got lots of supply first initially this is a brand new card so his price is going to drop a lot down like he's going to reach till 20 million or 22 million in between that once the exchange is done his price is going to skyrocket for sure just like marquis your guys marquis is your drop till 22 million and right now it's like 35 million coins because that's a meta card guys even this is a meta card look at this he's got like the best left back stats i think he might be probably better than roberto carlos as well so crazy good looking card even if you pack him just hold down guys don't try to sell him right now because his price is gonna bounce back for sure and finally we got dina Dale. although he might be a great card his price might not rebound as high as that of a cap de Villa because there are lots of good striker options but stats wise this is a crazy good card guys he's already 25.4 million coins quite cheap to be honest for such a lovely card look at him 98 pace 99 shooting 88 passing 97 dribbling create stats for a striker out of all these there are seven possible outcomes out of these three are w's guys rest all uh they are small uh l's or uh small uh w's you know so i would definitely recommend you to do this exchange guys it's worth the gamble in my opinion i mean if only if you got the coins of course even if you uh lose you might lose like probably 20 to 30 million coins at max guys, at the worst case scenario but yeah let's go and start opening these exchanges so this is exchange number one let's go i put in three manes i got the manes for 8.7 million coins luckily i was awake at the time of the reset and we got a hero guys that's disappointing it's italy italy i mean dean Natale, sorry uh that's not the best one you know this is an l uh, i'm losing like 8 to 8 to 10 million coins easily on this card let's move on though all we need is one ronaldo or theory on to cover up the loss so this is going to be the second exchange guys on this account it's two back-to-back -back heroes italy no way ea there is Ronaldo as well in the car in this exchange, but all we got is Di Natale into two. That is horrible, guys. I, mean, I think you should avoid this exchange, guys. If it's only giving Di Natale, this is going to be the final one. So with this, you're going to get an idea how much loss we are making from these three exchanges combined. Here we go, third exchange. Oh my God! Actually, we are making loss, guys. We are making like at least uh, you know. Uh, so guys, I might be making not a very big loss, but still I'm making a loss, guys, because I I spent like 27 million coins for each exchange, so that's like 81 million coins spent. Let's assume that Di Natale is 20 million, so we've got 40 million from Di Natale, and let's assume the Capdevera stays at 25 million, 65 million, so we're still making like a decent loss actually, 15 to 16 million coins loss. But anyways, guys, let's shift into other account now. So guys, let's do this exchange in another account. I spent like 86 million coins for the three exchange combined. Let's go and see if we can actually make a profit on this account in the previous account i made like 15 to 20 million coins loss which is bad we never know guys we might get lucky so let's go here comes the first one guys it's a hero once again okay this is spain cap de Villa is not a big loss for sure it's not a big loss but still it's a loss as of now let's move on to the second exchange guys here comes the second exchange and oh my god this is not giving anything apart from the heroes but you know cap is not a big loss as i told earlier so i'll take this one and it's two cap back to back but you know what you you don't sell him right now guys you just wait you know in five to six days i'm sure his price is going to rebound because he's one of the best left backs in the game the final one let's go come on ea please give me one oh my god no way are you serious ea 
All he got was just cat over here, guys. Guys, I might be wrong. I thought this exchange is worth it, but I might be wrong, guys. It's all gamble. It's a big gamble. I thought, you know, the, the rivals and uh, the heroes probability of packing them is similar, but no. The probability of packing heroes is much higher, guys. That's for sure. Now, I'm on my main account. So, before we open those packs, let's do a few 87 to 97 exchanges. Yesterday, these packs were mad for me, guys, because I packed tennis, Burkham, and also I packed... Uh, oh, wait. South Korea. Center back. Okay, this is Kim Minjae, which is not at all bad, guys. I packed Nedved and Burkham yesterday, guys. And today, I packed Kim Minjae and also 19-rated Irwin card, which is not at all bad. Look at that. I told you, these are the best exchanges in FC Mobile. Even they might be untradeable, I'll still do it every single day, guys. Because the chance of packing someone good in this is quite high. So, let's go again, complete the second exchange. Come on, be back-to-back. -back. Okay, it's not team of the year. Okay, it's Iran. I think the Jahan Baksh. Yeah, that's Jahan Baksh. And we got 89 Bremer. So let's go again. This is gonna be the third exchange. And uh, yeah, I think I got enough fodder. Yeah, I do have enough fodder, guys. So let's go. 87 to 97. The third one. Come on, please be another team off there. But it's not. It's Ivory Coast. Okay. CDM. Sangare. That's Sangare. Yeah. Uh, we got two team of the years though, which are okay because we can use them for other exchanges. All right. Now it's time to complete the 89 to 97. So we can do two of these every single day. And even this is a good one, guys. The, the, the probability of packing someone good is quite decent in this. Canada. All right. Uh, that's Jonathan David, guys. That's Jonathan David. It's just an 89. That's fine though. You know, you can't win in all the exchanges. You can get a few dubs for sure on the way. Let's go. This is going to be the next exchange, guys. Here we go. It's a team of there this time italy please be sent back maldini maldini please nah it's always bastoni guys every single time i just get bastoni but you know what i'm not complaining because uh that's fine now it's time to do the big exchange the 95 rate exchange so i got this kehil card for 9.9 .9 million coins each so let's go ahead and complete this one guys i'm gonna put it into the 95 rated uh players uh, exchange so here we go let's see what we're gonna pack here comes the pack it's a hero once again Italy, this is Di Natale. I'm gonna skip this one. I'm not interested to see the walkout animation now. This is gonna be the second one. And here we go. Come on. Oh my god. I haven't seen a single, uh, you know, non-hero pack. Nah, that is bad. We got the captive here though, but still, this is bad, guys. We deserve, uh, you know, the icons and he, uh, rivals players as well that are available in this pack. No way. Guys, I've done 12 exchanges, right? And all the 12, there have been, yeah, there have been just heroes. Guys, okay, I changed my mind. Don't do this exchange. I thought you should do this exchange, but the probability of packing hero is just high. In the comment section below, let me know if you uh, if you guys actually did pack anyone apart from the heroes. I think this is just a hero's pack, guys. I haven't seen a single non-hero pack. Nah, that is actually bad. You know what? I'm gonna do it one last time in another account, so let's go and see. All right, guys, so these are gonna be the final three exchanges. So far, we've been dropped so badly. Let's see if we can actually pack a non-hero player in this account. So let's go, guys. This is exchange number one come on ea all right finally i understood that there are division rival players in this and we got the worst one. i mean not division rival i mean uh rivals players in this pack but we got the worst one guys which is luca modric oh wait 39 million yeah i think it's gonna he's gonna drop below 30 million coins guys so that's the first one finally we packed a non-hero player and even that's a l guys okay this time it's an icon france okay this 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 might this might be a good exchange i mean you know what it's all luck based guys it's all luck based this is a dub so we are making profit on this account actually just from theory only and luka modric i think we made like 85 million coins or something so which is not at all bad and this is going to be the final one even if you pack a cap to here it's going to be a profit guys that's for sure so let's go all right finally we got a hero and it's yeah it's capped over here guys yeah in this account we made profit guys you know what gamble at your own risk this is just a gamble exchange it's not a guaranteed profit or something but you have a decent chance of making profit and even if you make a loss it's gonna be like 10 to 20 billion coins loss so get prepared you know when you do this exchange just get prepared that you you're gonna face a loss and do that exchange then you don't feel bad like me that's it guys i hope you all have enjoyed this exchange video if you did make sure to subscribe to my channel and go watch this video next